guys, so I'm just in the Uber on the way to work right now, obviously wearing the mask because COVID, trying to be safe. Um, this is the outfit, you guys already saw it when I was getting ready this morning. Um, usually, honestly, I live kind of far from work, so it takes me like 20 minutes in an Uber to get there. I have my coffee order already on the way because I need to caffeinate as soon as I get to work. I'm wearing contacts today for the first time in a long time. I feel like I used to wear contacts and glasses so often on top 10 that I just got lazy and stopped, but not anymore. So yes, here it is, it's quite sunny outside today. Love and life. Okay, so I just have my headphones on. Contrary to popular belief, I literally cannot go anywhere without headphones. Like I need to be listening to music all the time. I have my playlist for when I bike home, on my way to work, my gym playlist. I have a playlist for everything. So yes, I'll catch up with you guys when I'm actually at work. Bye. Okay guys, so I'm finally at my desk. You guys always wonder what the hell I do at work. I sit at this desk. It's quite nice, very roomy. Lighting is on point. And I basically script the videos. I see what I'm working on today. Right now I'm working on a collab with Lindsay. Guess who my uh, desk neighbor is? <laughs> How, how do you rate me as a desk neighbor? Do we get a lot of work done? Yeah, we get a lot of work done. You know, she's a great desk neighbor. Just a friendly reminder, guys. Drink water. <laughs> how many gallons is that? Just one. <laughs> oh, God. Sometimes me and Jared, we've, we've decided that maybe we may enforce quiet hours. You know, hours where we can't talk to each other, so we, uh, we're more productive, you know how it is. My Tim Hortons just came around, so caffeinated, ready to go, ready to start the day. Let's yeah, get think, it. I think, uh, I think we should enforce quiet hours right now. I don't think you guys realize that um, Jarrett talks so much shit, it's not even funny. What do you have to say for yourself? No friends helping out friends. Gotta help a brother out. Gotta help a brother out. You have to go zoom in and you have to say gotta help a brother out. Gotta help a brother out. <laughs> oh, also, so it's not just me and Jared in this room actually. Hello, Lindsay. Lindsay? Lindsay. Guys, I've just embarrassed myself. I'm so happy that was caught on camera. <laughs> no, it's it's because I'm talking to Lindsay and doing a collab with her, and it was just at the tip of my oh, tongue. That makes sense. I'm sorry, I feel like a bitch. This is not Lindsay. This is the lovely Mackenzie. Oh yes, here we go. Look at her, all pretty. Oh guys, this lighting is making me look ugly. And about Jared, he doesn't shut up. <laughs> he doesn't shut up. I'm telling you, him, you guys think I talk so much? I don't talk that much. I'm literally sitting here listening to fucking music, getting my work done, when you fucking run around parade doing your videos. Okay, I just, I just feel nothing but negative energy coming off Jared all the time. I'm just trying to come in and vibe, and he's just, it's Bro, I just. I can see a vibe if you want me to fucking vibe. <laughs> Back to work. Okay, hey. hey guys, okay, we're doing a collab today. These lights are just not doing well for e either of us right now. Yeah. I'm excited. Let's get it! Oh, the lights are gone. <laughs> Let's get it! Okay, you guys, I'm doing my outfit of the day walk. Chris is shooting me. I love this. Here we go, it's Inception. Okay, guys, this is the outfit of the day. I got this from Miss Guided. I'm doing a black and white vibe. We've got the red, we've got the red lipsticks, the Air Forces. There we go. Can I just do a quick turn? Oh, here you go. 
And Chris knows how many times I do this, because sometimes I look fat, sometimes I'm not sucking in my stomach enough, sometimes it's just not going well. Chris knows, he knows the struggle. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, I just finished filming the collab with Lindsay and now I'm filming a top 10 central collab with Jared. Hey! And I know this seems like we're very close, we're in the same social circle, so don't worry about social distancing. Yeah, we're good. It's, if yeah. I was gonna get the Rona, I would've had by now. Yeah, literally. At least from her. I don't know. <laughs> okay, in I'm not trying to challenge it. Okay, you're talking way too much. <laughs> Always! Hello, I'm back in my desk now. I just filmed a collab with Lindsay, a central with Jared. And honestly, I'm quite sweaty right now because the lights are intense upstairs. So I'm sweaty, but I'm looking at you right in the camera. I keep forgetting, I keep looking up at me when I should be lo looking straight at you guys. But yes, back to work, cash in a bit. Hello guys, so I've finally taken my lunch break. It's 3.20 and for some reason I take a really late lunch. So I have this, look at this meal, it's called the Sloppy Joe. I do this like meal plan thing because I'm trying to lose weight and it barely has carbs in it. So I'm doing that at the moment. Honestly, it's been such a slow day. Like I wish I could give you guys something more exciting to see, but this is literally what it is. Like around like 2.30, 3.30 during the day, like I just hit a wall of just like unproduct unproductivity, unproductiveness. I just hit a wall of unproductiveness and just like I try and push through it, but it's actually very hard. Jared's going through the same thing right now as we speak. Um, <laughs> Friday too, so it's like even. Yeah, and Fridays always makes it worse because you're so ready for the weekend. But I'm not gonna be negative. Usually it's actually very like Mondays are always lit because you're back, you're energized, you're ready to go. So I'm gonna eat. Obviously, I have to tie my hair up because my hair is long, and I'm gonna eat this meal real good. And I think it's also because I just haven't eaten all day other than like my coffee in the morning and my um, sesame bagel and of course breakfast. What am I talking about? I have eaten today. <laughs> I look like an egg. Okay, it's literally just your bum in it. I'm like stretching, man. My legs are killing me. Okay, I also have these on my desk. So I always, I look like a, a proper egg, but my lips look nice and my skin looks nice. Oh my god, I'm good looking. But yeah, okay. So I've been, um, I've been eating these lentils. They're really good in protein. So I'm trying to, you know, stay healthy at work. So I'm gonna eat, and I'm not gonna record while I am eating because a bitch needs a break, you guys. I'm so used to looking above. I used to look at the camera. Oh my god. So yeah, I'm gonna take a break. So so far, I've filmed two videos. I'm nearly done scripting this top ten, but it's taking me a bit of a while. So it's not about that really. And usually during my lunch break, I literally just watch the YouTube channel, The Dodo. I don't know if you guys have heard of it, but it's basically like, you know, those like clickbait titles where it's like, ooh, like sick kitten, like found on the street, cries for help. And then like, she's magically saved at the end. And these videos always make me so sad, but I'm always like, oh my God, look at this gun, look at this dog, like I bloody love it. I just love, I love animals, it's a joke. I don't know if you guys can see, actually, let me bring you close up to my forehead. First of all, I like, Let's try and zoom in. Okay, so basically I went out with my friends yesterday. Not out, I went to my friend's house yesterday and we were chilling on his like patio sort of thing and I got bit by so many mosquitoes. There's one right here and it really freaking hurts. There's one right here and I've had it. Look how nice my tan looks, you guys. I'm happy about that. Just filming this vlog has just put me in a better mood. Hey guys, so I'm just about to start my bike ride to go home, so I will check back with you once I'm sweaty as hell at home. So I just got home from biking. As you can see, I'm sweating so much. I wiped the sweat off, so I wouldn't look that shiny on camera. But I just got home. It was a long ass day at work. I'm so glad. Do you hear the sirens? Fuck you, sirens! Sorry, got a bit aggressive there. You know how I am. I'm glad it's Friday, which means it's the weekend. Um, I'm gonna chill for a bit, chill with my cat. Look at baby! Hi! Hi, Nanny! <laughs> Hi! 
Nanny. Ooh. You know how it's like the Queen song, Mama, but it's Nanny. Nanny. Ooh. So that's actually what I do all the time. I just walk around the house singing that. It's actually really fucking funny. Wow, I didn't realize how bad of an angle this was, but okay, I look like an egg. Um, but yes, okay, I'm gonna relax for a bit, chill with Nini, and then I'm gonna get started on my workout, so I will be back when I'm working out. So literally every day as I come back from work, I'll lie down for a while on the sofa and every single day Nini will come and lie with me and let me spoon her and just fall asleep and then usually I fall asleep as well because I just don't want to move and ruin her sleep. So I will just sleep with her, just changing some positions here. Hi. She likes fitting herself right in there. Don't you, Nini? Don't you? Hey. She's an angel. So we're gonna do this for the next 45 minutes. Yeah, sounds about right. Hi guys, I'm back. So I decided I'm not gonna work out because basically I was petting Nini. I don't know if you can see, my eye is so unbelievably swollen. It's a joke. <laughs> oh dear, bless me. My allergies are really bloody bad right now. I've got Nini over here, still here. She's cute, but she has no idea just how allergic I am to her. She's hypoallergenic, but I always have to go, obviously, above and beyond and just put my face in her belly. And basically, there was like three of her furs just stuck in my eye, um, which is why I had to take my contacts off as well, because my eye was going to get hella swollen, more so than it is right now. And this literally happens to me on a weekly, almost daily basis. Not this bad, but like I get cat allergies every single day. Yeah, I still love her. It's a love, love relationship, there's no hate. And I'm gonna take an anti-allergy now and I will catch up with you in a bit. Okay, so I'm back and as you can see, my eye has kind of like, like the swelling has gone down, but it's still pretty bad. But I look a lot better now. I realize I need to not vlog when my hair is tied up because I look like a proper egg. So it is nearly 9 p.m. If you're wondering what I've been doing for the last few hours, I've literally just been laying on the sofa like an egg, just trying to make the swelling go down. And now it finally has, so I'm gonna make myself some dinner now because I'm hungry, but like it's not gonna be proper dinner because I'm lazy today, I just can't be bothered. So we are gonna be making some gourmet turkey sandwiches. Stay tuned. Hello guys, welcome to Eamon's Kitchen. <laughs> so yes, I'm making a turkey sandwich. There's a lot of components that go into this. First of all, hickory smoked turkey breast. You gotta have a bit of that. And they're so low in calories. Dude, I hope you realize, you guys, I'm gonna speak about this turkey sandwich like I'm making something on final table for like Gordon Ramsay. Okay, so brown bread. I'm having brown bread because I always have brown bread. Even white bread, it's just not the vibe. It doesn't pass the vibe check. And for my condiments, I feel like a lot of people are gonna hate me in the comments because people don't like mayo or they don't like blah blah This is what I put on my sandwich. Mayo, because you can't have a turkey sandwich and not have mayo. You're bloody psychotic if you do that. Then... I'm gonna put ketchup for that tang, you know, to cut the to cut the acidity with some ketchup. And then of course, the star of the show, Dijon mustard. Say what you want, I don't care. It ends up tasting really damn good, so come at me, bro. I'm gonna have two sandwiches of um, because I've barely eaten today. As you guys know, I was hangry at work. Um, so yes, I'm gonna be making these goddamn sandwiches. Okay. Got my plate ready. So yes, as I'm waiting for the toast to settle, I'm waiting for the toast, I'm waiting for the toast. I will check back with you guys. Um, I'm gonna show you the making and blah, 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 blah.
Hi guys, did you enjoy that uh, tasty-esque <laughs> thing that I just did there? <laughs> Please excuse my gross ass nails. I had shellac, I peeled them off like an absolute dumbass. And now my nails are breaking and they're gross, so let's not talk about that. But as you can see, the sandwiches are done. Gourmet, a la carte, amen. And now, to top it all off, we got the juice, we got the juice. Um, this is orange peach mango. I'm a tropical bay and I love my tropical fruit. And you just put a bit of like that. Guys, full glass, because I ain't a bitch. There we go. And the meal is now complete. I'm gonna go enjoy this. And yes, I'll be back. Okay guys, it's the end of the night now. I'm exhausted. Thankfully it's Saturday tomorrow so I can sleep in and have a good weekend. But now, first things first, skincare above all. Never sleep with your makeup on so I'm gonna be taking my makeup off right now. Also, contrary to popular belief, never use makeup or wipes to take off your makeup. They're actually very abrasive. Um, and they exfoliate your skin way more than it needs to be exfoliated. I know this because my mom's a dermatologist, so got that skincare hack. So I have these makeup wipes, and of course I have the Garnier. I'm saying it like I know what I'm talking about. I actually do know what I'm talking about. Micella water, and that's how I take my makeup off. Um, and be really gentle around your eyes, etc. And yes, I'm gonna do that now. <laughs> Taking my makeup off. This is the first time I'm on camera without any makeup. I hope I look good. I can't see myself. But even if I don't look good, I don't fucking care. Okay, you guys, now to patch dry the face. And again, never with a towel, you idiots. With the power of editing, I'm back. <laughs> okay, I use a kitchen tissue because I feel like toilet roll is just too fibrous and it just sticks to my skin. So, pat dry, pat dry, pat dry. Hope you guys are all enjoying this. I know this is the content you came to see. <laughs> okay. And the final step, moisturization. I love Cetaphil, I swear by this. I've been on this for like literally six years because my mom's like, this is the best, nothing else matters. So yes, just gonna moisturize, get all up in there, get the neck, make sure you get your neck. And yeah, that is the end of my night routine. Let me put my glasses back on so I can see. Got a kingdom glasses. Okay, you guys, now I'm just about to go to bed now. So, good night. I hope you enjoyed a day in my life. Is that what you thought it would be? Let me know in the comments below. Bye.